According to recent studies, the global demand for energy is increasing and oil and gas are projected to remain the primary source for energy through 2050. Oil and gas play a dominant role in the energy mix and economy due to reliability, affordability and widespread availability. Oil and gas does a lot more than power cars and heat our homes. It takes petroleum to build computers, iPhones, microchips, cars, boats, clothing, food, pharmaceuticals and many other things in the world that we rely on daily. The blue economy itself is highly dependent on oil and gas to fuel the shipping, fishing and recreation industries. Cedro is a leading offshore drilling contractor. Uh, we operate in various geographies around the world. We utilise the latest technology to safely and efficiently unlock oil and gas reserves in major hydrocarbon basins around the world. We have a predominantly floater focused fleet and we use our assets in conjunction with our well-trained and experienced crews to, to operate for our clients worldwide. We remain steadfast in our belief that it is going to be an enduring um, upcycle for the oil and gas industry. As the world population growth continues, uh, we expect that oil and gas will be an important source of supply in the energy mix going forward. And when we think about the nature of offshore oil and gas production relative to onshore, we believe that um, it is both has a preferential carbon footprint because of the size and the volumes that can be produced from offshore reservoirs. Our focus areas of in the environment, safe operations, social and governance reflect our commitment to aligning with the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. For the future, we have the responsibility to continually embrace and innovate new sustainable practices. We'll be deploying energy efficiency technologies and automation across our fleet to improve operational outcomes. Safety consciousness is a fundamental value at Sea Drill, and we take pride in providing the best qualified and most highly trained crews. No one's more important than our employees, they are our top priority. Safety is at the heart of everything Seedroll does. We have developed additional health and mental health programs, such as our Be Well program. Through these initiatives, we ensure that our people receive the best preventive care, both mentally and physically. Seedroll invests in safety training for the offshore crews in many different ways. One example is our Start Safe seminars. These seminars focus on the the most basics, but yet a core element of uh, our PMID process, which is a task planning system that stands for plan, identify, manage, execute, and debrief. The, the Start Safe seminar allows us to use our tools in the learning environment where we can fail safe and learn from our debriefs to improve. Cereal is dedicated to enhancing the capabilities and skills and the competencies of our workforce. We have achieved a significant milestone in, in 2023 with the establishment of the Seedville Development Academy in Dubai, which is equipped with a state-of-the-art drilling simulator that allows our employees to enhance their skills. Drilling automation improves safety in the drilling industry. Historically, the oil and gas industry has been associated with dirty, hands-on work with heavy machinery. At Seedwell, we're changing that perception by developing technologies that takes the human beings out of the line of fire and out of the red zone or the hazardous areas on board a rig. Our drillers are more often behind the screen, monitoring and adjusting drilling operations with a joystick, not their hands. Automation can improve safety by reducing the risk of human errors and enhancing the ability to respond quickly to potential hazards. We are constantly innovating and deploying the latest technology to reduce our fleet's carbon footprint. For example, the West Saturn is the latest generation drill ship that underwent significant upgrades in 2022 to change its carbon footprint and to make its operation more efficient. From advanced technologies on our subsea equipment and also on board our rigs, Sea Drill does its best to ensure that we minimise our impact on the waters in which we operate. So at Sea Drill, it's important that we look at what sustainability is. Forming the Sustainability Committee helped us 
draw departments into the conversation and allow them to evaluate the priorities that they could impact. Uh, the priorities obviously include the E, environmental, what we can do about reducing our greenhouse gas emissions, what technologies can be used to um, improve that beyond just efficiencies that we can do by changing our way we work. And secondly, we looked at the social aspect, the human rights, the, the health and welfare of our own people, and what we could do to improve the strain and stress of remote work. We also looked at governance and how we apply and comply with international regulation, uh, not only in the marine industry, but also in the areas we work. Sea Drill, as a sustainable member of the offshore drilling community, is focused on reducing our carbon intensity of our operations. This focus is embedded in three core strategies. Number one, new technologies. Number two, energy efficiency and operational discipline. And number three, digitization analysis of our data. We work very closely with our clients and invest in new technologies to make our rigs more efficient. On the West Saturn drill ship, we successfully implemented an advanced generator protection system that allows the rig to run fewer engines. When running fewer engines, we burn less fuel and create less emissions. We are also running pilots or tests on fuel additives that improve the combustion of engines. We are also following new technologies around alternative fuel injection, fuel blending, fuel processing, using alternative fuels like hydrogen, methanol, and ethanol. Our second core strategy is energy efficiency and operational discipline. This is more of an organic approach to our processes and procedures to understand where we use fuel and how we can operate more efficiently. The third core strategy is digitization. The equipment on our vessels has thousands of sensors which produce immense amounts of data. Understanding this data allows us to understand where we use our energy and to target areas where we need to improve. We can optimize out of service periods, therefore being more operationally efficient. Managed pressure drilling, or MPD, technologies and blowout preventers, or BOPs, are essential tools in drilling a well safely and efficiently. They also help protect the environment by preventing spills and the unreleased discharge of hydrocarbons into the environment. Further to well control, containment and mitigation are also very important. One of the activities that we do at Sea Drill to protect marine life is called hole cleaning. The hull is the submerged structure of the vessel. Because it is submerged and sitting in seawater all day, marine growth grows rapidly on it. Hull cleaning is the removal of this marine growth from the vessel. Marine growth is very heavy. It's a very rough surface, barnacles and such, on, a, on the skin of a hull. It produces drag. So the rig can't move through the water efficiently and water can't move around the rig efficiently. Hole cleaning also helps us mitigate the risk of transferring marine organisms from one marine environment to another marine environment. So when it comes to marine life and biodiversity, it's important that we have no net loss on any protected or threatened species, and that our management system enables us to work with minimum or no impact to the, the marine environment. It's important that the framework's in place so that it provides guidance internally to our employees on how to operate our rigs. Another way we protect marine life and biodiversity is through ballast water management and ballast water treatment plans. Ballast water is the seawater that you bring on board the vessel and you move it around in different tanks to keep the vessel stable. Our ballast water management plans and ballast water treatment systems prevent the release of marine organisms and pathogens into coastal waters. Cedro will continue to set the standard in offshore drilling and we remain committed to environmental stewardship, operational excellence and preserving the well-being of our people and the communities in which they operate. At Cedro we recognise the profound responsibility that comes with operating offshore and as we navigate the ever-evolving industry landscape, uh, we remain resolute and steadfast in our commitment to sustainable practices in the technologies that we deploy and in the practices that we apply.